a close-up on Carla's nose. She's got a very expressive nose. Very Some sorry. people like... Oh my god! This sh sorry. <laughs> Hey, it's Scopey with Kin. I'm Anne Lai and I'm here with these lovely ladies. And I know we're enjoying some aromatic coffee right here, but today we're talking about Kin cuisine. We're talking about the food that you see on Kin every day, every episode. All the Kin fans want to know. Is the food real? Yes! Oh, of course! <laughs> most most, most of most. the food. There's some food in our fridge at the Bala's house that is not real. Like our carton of eggs, they're fake eggs. But here, all real. Yeah. 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 Oh, real. yeah, and yes, even, of even, course. Yeah. Even at the Hassan's also, it's real. Yeah. 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 So it's only, it's only the Bala, <laughs> Bala. The Bala speak, right? <laughs> I'm going to look for the genius behind Kin Cuisine. Meanwhile, I'll let you guys chit chat okay. and I'll be back with lunch. Ooh. <laughs> See ya! And this person here, Kin fans, is Chef Bell, the culinary mastermind behind all the food you see on Kin. Chef Bell. Tell me more about the Kin food classics. Tauhu Telur, mm -hmm. Seafood Lemak Linguini from Adina's Restaurant. Mm -hmm. Pandan Tauhui from Boss Lady Tauhui. And the macarons from Lux Cafe. The thing is, I filmed one scene in Lux before, okay? And I swear the macarons there were inedible. Not because they were bad, but they were fake, right? They are real, just inedible. Why are they inedible? I, I tried to eat one this <laughs> Oh, it's you! <laughs> you really love your macarons, huh? Well, you know, cookies are either crispy or chewy. But a macaron manages to do both. So how different is it preparing food for a film set compared to preparing food for a real restaurant? In a real restaurant, the focus is more on the taste. That means you need to have a consistent taste every time you serve the food. So for filming, the focus is more on the looks. Do I get to try anything at all? Since you have an inedible macaron before, you might want to try something that's edible. Thank you, Chef Bell. Thank you. Mmm. Oh, ladies, you will get to eat soon. But not yet. Especially you, Margaret. Please put the fork down. Thank you very much. This is the Kin Cuisine Quiz. Okay? You've got to answer these quiz questions. What does... Boss lady sell besides Tao Hui. Hands up. Soya bean drink, uh, ice jelly drink, ham chim bang, the yu tiao, the, the tart, uh, curry puff, no more already. That's it. Oh. Very good. good. One point to Margaret. Not yet, not yet, not yet. What did May Wan serve Maxine when she didn't have egg tarts? Tao Hui. Bang. <laughs> That was uh, yes. the butterfly bun. <laughs> 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 Yong Tiao? Yeah. Correct! Ah! <laughs> what ingredient is needed to set the Tao Hui? Uh, oh, 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 soy bean! Soy bean! Soy bean! Does that count? No, that's the ingredient. No. Flour! Same some powder, right? Malcolm powder. <laughs> Johnson and Johnson. I mean, it's something powder. I know. Mm -hmm. Jimson powder, no. Actually, yeah. yeah, yeah. Gypsum right. oh. powder. Oh. What is Adina's most popular dish? Uh, uh, uh. Okay, Carla. Rendang correct! Carla, one more! <laughs> what did Roz add to her Asam Padas experiment? <laughs> you gave me that recipe! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I know some people like. Chinchalo! Correct! Chinchalo! Hey, you messed up my recipe! You didn't mess up Adina's recipe! This is wrong! Every dish in the menu has been perfected over the years. What makes you think you can do better? What station did Zara set up so customers could help themselves when she took charge of the restaurant? Self-service water station. Correct! What's usually for breakfast at 
for Hassan, Balas, and Joe. Nasi lemak for Adina. Oh, uh, for the Hassan, uh, it'll be the uh, nasi lemak. Mm -hmm. The lows will be porridge. Mm -hmm. uh, Balas will be French toast. Mm, three, two point five, correct. Two point five because. Porridge on its own is a bit plain. Oh, porridge and UTL. Yes, correct. <laughs> porridge and UTL. <laughs> so right now, after the quiz, the winner is Mark. Yay! Now, we still have part two. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to blindfold you and then we're going to serve you some dishes and you're going to try and figure out first what the dish is and then the three main ingredients. Your nostrils have had their fill, I'm quite sure. A close up on Carla's nose. <laughs> Look at that. She's got a very expressive nose. Your time starts now. Nasi goreng. Peanut. <laughs> the ingredient is rice and tovies and um, mixed vegetables. Okay. Yeah. 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 Get one for you. <laughs> the next dish is in front of you. Go. Mm. Ah, ah. Yes, Ariati. Okay. Roti kirai. It's curry and then flour and you have eggs. Correct, Chef yes, Bell? Correct. Absolutely correct, Ariati. One more point. I see that. Roti kirai. I shall finish this. Ladies, now the third dish is in front of you. Your taste test starts now. Yes, Ariati. Tahu telur. Tahu. A tofu? It's what was on the table oh, just now. Wrong dish. Huh? Eh. Okay. Gajo, gajo. Tahu, the long beans, and bean sprout. Absolutely correct. 1.2 commas. <laughs> okay, so the queen of kin cuisine is... Or should I say, ah... Ariati <laughs> and Margaret. <laughs> Just look on. Yeah. 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 No, no, no. Just share, just share, just share, just share. Enjoy. Bon appetit. Yeah. I'm about to walk away, man. <laughs> and we'll see you next time on Kopi with Kid. Bye. Bye.